What's going on guys? Today I'm going to show you guys how to capture the mythical Pokemon Arceus in Pixelmon Generations. So in the latest update for Pixelmon Generations, they actually introduced a new method on how to obtain Arceus. Before, you used to just have it spawn on you in a random biome. I think it was like a plains biome. I don't really know. I don't remember either. Uh, but now there's actual way to spawn it in. Just like any other legendary that we've covered here on this channel, it has a method to get it. And I'm going to be real with you guys, it is one of the most grindy ways to capture Arceus, or one of the most grindy ways to capture any Pokemon, to be honest with you. I thought Urshifu and Kofu were bad, but Arceus is on another level. Uh, so, this is pretty much going to determine if you guys are dedicated to completing your Pokédex in Pixelmon Generations. So uh, if you guys are excited for this type of video, make sure to smash that like button. I want to see 20 likes on this video. That is our goal for today. Of course, subscribe if you are new. Turn on those notifications to stay up to date with Pixelmon uh, and any updates that come to Pixelmon. And of course, of course, comment down below if you like these type of videos and you guys want to see some more. If, of course, you guys want me to do a specific Pokemon I haven't done already, this is your best time to let me know. Hey. Can you do this? You haven't done this yet. Can you please show us how to capture this? I got you. Say less. But this time, let's get started with how to catch Arceus in Pixelmon. Alright, so this is the first person that we need to speak to. This is the NPC that gives you the quest on how to capture uh, Arceus. I will go ahead and throw it out there that this quest can only be done once per player. So once you've already done it, you're not getting another Arceus. Unless you can go to like, I think Origin Islands is a thing on Pixelmon Generations. So, but other than that though, like... Through this method, this is the only one that you are going to be able to get, so good luck, right? But you're going to speak to him, he's going to tell you the quest and what exactly you need to do so, and that's what we have to do. So let's uh, go over to him and talk to him. So we're going to go ahead and right click, uh, and he'll tell us in chat, you need to find these unknown, and it's basically all of them from A through Z, plus exclamation point, and the question mark. And you still need to find these plates, which is the Splash, the Meadow, the Earth, the Zap, and the Draco. I don't know exactly what they really represent, but I just know that I have to get them. So let's go ahead and get started with getting them. So I've captured a few unknown as we go, and I want to come back to him and speak to him to see if he updates our list of what we need. So we're going to speak to him, and yeah, it's significantly dropped down as we've caught more unknown. So uh, that's something to know is like it keeps progress for you. Uh, I will note that you do have to capture the unknowns. I don't know if uh, trading with another player kind of works. I don't know if that's the case, but I've been capturing everything myself and I know this is where the grinding part comes because unknown have a really small spawn rate and I mean, they're kind of easy to catch, but that spawn rate kind of hurts a lot. You know what I mean? So good luck. So now when you speak to Damos after uh, capturing all the unknowns, he doesn't tell you that he needs them anymore. It's time to move on. So now it's time for us to get all the plates. All right, so I got all my plates in the hot bar now. Now it's time to speak to him and it should complete the quest. So Damos, here it is, the jewel of life. Use it at the time space altar and you'll be visited by a very special Pokemon. This is actually kind of perfect. The only thing is, we aren't necessarily done yet. We still need a few more things for this to work. All right, so now the next thing that we need, it's actually kind of the last thing that we need. It's still going to be kind of hard to come by, but we also need to have the three legendary Pokemon from Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum in our party. So we do need to have Giratina, we do need to have Dialga, and we do need to have Palkia. Shout out to Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl coming at the end of the year. If you guys want to see some Pokemon content, of course, make sure to check out my second channel. Uh, link will be in the description down below. And I do a lot of Pokemon stuff. Shiny hunting, Let's Plays, things of that nature, so check that out. But... Back to this. So yeah, we need all three of the legendary Pokemon from uh, Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum. And then now we have the Jewel of Life. We're gonna go ahead and right click the Time Space Altar and let's hope for the best. So yeah, here comes the particles. And once it reaches to the top, you know the deal. It's gonna spawn in an Arceus and we are going to capture him. Let's see, whoa, come on. There it is, the Arceus is here. And of course, we have some Master Balls. We, we didn't come not prepared for this legendary. We wanna capture this, uh, the Arceus and a Master Ball just to make the whole process a little bit easier. And there we go, the creator of all the new, uh, of course my scroll button wants to grab all the XP, but yeah, we, got, we have a brand new Legendary on the squad. And that's exactly how to capture the mythical Pokemon Arceus in Pixelmon Generations using the brand new method. If you guys enjoyed this type of video, make sure to smash that like button. Like I said, we are on the goal to 20 likes this video. I feel like that's a good number to hit. Of course, subscribe if you are new. Turn on those notifications so you guys can stay up to date with Pixelmon con content. 
of course comment down below if you guys want to see some sort, sort of tutorial like this on another pokemon let me know down in the comment section below apparently there's a lot of pokemon i still haven't done this type of tutorial for so of course let me know what you guys want to see next of course i highly encourage you guys to check out the rest of the videos on this channel if you guys want to see how i captured giratina and palkia and dialga there is a tutorial here on this channel and if you guys want to see any other things like Meloetta, the forces of nature, the Reggie Trio, things like that, of course, check out those videos as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.